Geobyte. Now, let us get into the topic Adding Made Easy. Hey, can you add 37 and 21? Yes, why not? 58. How did you do that much fastly? Simple. I will show you. I separated 37 into 30 and 7. I divided 21 into 20 and 1. I added 7 and 1 that is 7 plus 1 is 8 and 30 plus 20 is 50. 58. 58. Oh, okay then. I think you understood the solving of shortcut method. I will give you two numbers. Will you solve? Yes. Okay. 26 and 43. Okay. Let us divide 26 into 20 and 6 and 43 into 40 and 3. 20 plus 40 is 60 plus 6 plus 3 is 9. 60 plus 9 is 69. Yes, you understood. Hey, can you show us another shortcut method? Yes, why not? Give me numbers. Numbers, yes, 33 and 56. Okay. If we add 33 plus 56. Did you say this? Yes. Yeah. Now we can divide 33 as 30 plus 3. Isn't it? Yes. Yes. Again this plus. We can divide 56 into 50. Plus 6. Isn't it? Yes, of course. Yeah. First, let us add the numbers. That is, these two numbers. We will get 30 plus 50. 0 plus 0. 0. 3 plus 5. 8. We will get 30 plus 50 as 80. And... Let us write these two numbers as it is. Now, let us add these two numbers. Let 80 be as it is. 3 plus 6 is 9. Let us write plus 9. 80 plus 9 is 89. Now, let us see one more problem in the same method. We have 37 plus 22. Let us do it like we divide 37 into 30 plus 7. Write the plus here and we will divide 22 into 20 plus 2. Now let us add these two numbers, we got 30 plus 20, 0 plus 0, 0, 3 plus 2, 5. So, 30 plus 20 is 50 plus, let us write the numbers as it is, plus 7. Plus 2. Now let us add these two numbers. 
7 plus 2 is 9. Now 50 plus 9 is 59. I have showed you two problems. Can you solve this? Okay, let us try. Let us divide 73 into 70 plus 3. 70 plus 3. Let us write plus as it is. Let us divide 24 into 20 plus 4. 20 plus 4. First, let us add 70 plus 20. 70 plus 20. 0 plus 0 is 0. 7 plus 2 is 9. So, 70 plus 20 is equal to 90. Now, let us write the remaining numbers. Plus 3 plus 4. 3 plus 4 is 7. 90 plus 7. So, 90 plus 7 is 97. Is this correct? Yes, you did it perfect. Hey kids, there is a small activity for you. Try to solve the next questions in your mind given in the textbook. Children, the next topic is a story. Regarding that story, we have some questions. Number of these are 48. Number of rabbits are 27. Now, we will represent these numbers in the form of 10 card and 1 card. That is, we can write 48 as 4 10 cards, 8 1 cards. Let us do it. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 10 cards and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 1 cards. Now, let us write this 27 also in the form of 10 card and 1 card. That is, we have 2 10 cards. 1, 2 and 7 1 cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Now, if you see, we have 8 1 cards here and 7 1 cards here. If I take 10 1 cards in a single 10 card, that is, these 8 cards and these 2 cards are 10 cards, I will represent these 10 cards as a single 10 card. Now, how many 1 cards are remaining? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Let us write 5 in the 1's place and we got a 10 here in the 10's place. Let us write 1 in the 10's place. Now, let us add how many 10 cards are left? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Let us write 7 in the 10's place. So, we have 75 deeds and rabbits.
children similarly we need to add the total number of squirrels and birds number of birds are 124 number of squirrels are 38 now let us add these two numbers first let us represent these numbers in the form of cards let us represent using 100 card 10 card and 1 card if you see the first number that is 124 we can represent it by a 100 card and two 10 cards and four 1 cards let us do it 100 card and 1 2 two 10 cards and 1 2 3 four four 1 cards now let us represent this number using cards here we have 38 that is 3 10 cards 8 1 cards let us do 1 2 3 three ten cards and 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 eight eight one cards now let us count one cards and make 10 one cards as a single 10 card 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 ten one cards we will replace with a single 10 card now how many one cards are left one two let us write two in the ones place we got a one ten card let us write here now let us count how many ten cards are there one two three four five six let us write Six in the tens place. Now let us count how many hundred cards are there. One. Let us write one. Now how much we got? One sixty two. So the total number of squirrels and birds are one sixty two. Children, now. We need to add the total number of birds and squirrels with the total number of deer and rabbits. That is one sixty two plus seventy five. Now let us represent these two numbers with cards. Let us represent one sixty two as One hundred card, six ten cards, and two one cards. Let us do it. One hundred card, one, two, three, four. Five, six, six ten cards, and one, two, two one cards. Now let us represent seventy-five as seven ten cards, five one cards. One, two, three. 
फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन सेवन टेन कार्ड्स एंड वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव फाइव वन कार्ड्स नाउ लेट अस काउंट हाउ मेनी वन कार्ड्स आर देर वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन सेवन वन कार्ड्स आर देर लेट अस राइट सेवन इन द वन प्लेस नाउ लेट अस काउंट टेन कार्ड्स एंड मेक ए ग्रुप ऑफ टेन कार्ड्स इनटू अ सिंगल हंड्रेड कार्ड दैट इज वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट नाइन टेन नाउ लेट अस राउंड अप दीज टेन टेन कार्ड्स एंड रिप्लेस इट इनटू अ सिंगल हंड्रेड कार्ड नाउ हाउ मेनी टेन कार्ड्स आर लेफ्ट वन टू थ्री लेट अस राइट थ्री इन द टेन प्लेस लेट अस काउंट हाउ मेनी हंड्रेड कार्ड्स आर देर वन टू लेट अस राइट टू दैट इज वी हैव हंड्रेड कार्ड हियर वी नीड टू कैरी वन नाउ वी विल राइट टू एंड हियर आल्सो वी विल गेट टू सो द टोटल नंबर ऑफ बर्ड्स एंड स्क्वेरल्स विद द टोटल नंबर ऑफ डीज एंड रैबिट्स इज 237 द रिमेनिंग टॉपिक्स विल बी कवर्ड इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियो यू आर वेलकम टू कांटेक्ट अस ऑन टेलीग्राम टू क्लेरिफाई योर डाउट्स regarding these topics the link is given in the description thank you for watching please do like share comment and subscribe to geobyte geobyte